Hello? Hello. Check, check, check. Um, welcome back, everyone, to another episode of Ruby. This is Volume 5, Chapter 8, Alone Together. So last time, we had a bit of discussion. It's been a couple weeks for me, to be honest. Um, but it's been, it was a <laughs> discussion between, uh, you know, Ruby and Weiss and Yang all reunited and uh, Jean and Nora, Ren, Oscar, and Crow are all together, just sort of catching up. Um, they're talking about sort of their plans for what to do next. Um, you know, sort of secrets being revealed about Crow can transform and so can Raven. Um, and sort of the, the not mischievous, um, manipulating, maybe uh, sinister side of Oz. Um, but uh, on the other hand, we also got, uh, I believe it was Cinder, Emerald, Mercury, and Watts are going to the Raven's Bandits um, to get the Spring Maiden. So we'll see where we end up here in this chapter. Let's go. You're up early. Jesus. <laughs> hey, sis. Boop. <laughs> what are you doing up? Can't fall back asleep. Ah, uh, me neither. Well, fortunately, <laughs> coffee exists. Worry, I put in blasphemous amounts of cream and sugar just for you. <laughs> oh yeah, nice way strikes again. I will pour this on you and it will burn. <laughs> <laughs> can't believe we're actually in Mistral. That's what you can't believe? Well, yeah, and all the other magic and stuff. But okay, you know what I mean. I honestly wasn't sure if I'd ever see you two again. Aww. Well, here's to defying expectations. I just wish Blake could be here with us. Mm. Yeah, well, she made her choice. Oh, they're still mad at her. What's her that? Yang's still to mad at her. I mean, she could have been here if she just stuck around. It's no big deal, though. We'll be fine. Don't you want her here? Why would I want her here? Are you still mad at her for leaving? Oh, whatever gave you that idea, Ruby. No, I'm totally fine. I'm great. Okay, calm down. Don't tell me to calm down! Whoa, Yang. Don't break it. <laughs> whatever. Ready to go? Be right there. What's that? It's going to be too far, not sure what to do. Find a quiet spot. No. <laughs> Shoot, I didn't read the whole thing. But that was from Ilya, I saw. We going recruiting or what? We've got the entire nocturnal section to hit up. You okay? Yeah, I'll meet you there. I need to take care of something first. So interesting. Yeah. Look, Ruby, I really don't want to talk about it, okay? Can you just leave me alone for a bit? It's Oscar. Oh, nice. Wow. Oh. 
Hey, Weiss, did you need something? Her hair is so ridiculously long. I know she's our teammate, but I'm not just going to change my mind. I'm sorry, I just... I don't think you know what it's like to be left. You have a giant family. Mm -hmm. Recitals to perform at. Dinners to attend. But they don't care about her. I didn't have any of that. My mom left me. Ruby's mom left too. Ty was always busy with school and Ruby couldn't even talk yet. I had to pick up the pieces. I had to keep things together. Alone. Weiss, if you have something to say, then say it. When I was 10, my dad finally admitted to my mom that the only reason he married her was for the family name. It was actually on my birthday. He missed the big dinner. She got mad. He finally snapped. I think she already knew. Looking back, I think I knew too. But hearing him say it finally pushed her over the edge. First, it was separate lunches and dinners, opposite balconies at my recitals, a glass of wine here, a glass of wine there. Why can't she just divorce him? Then it was no dinners, no recitals, a bottle of wine here, and well, you get the idea. I'm really sorry. I shouldn't have assumed. You're right, though. I don't know loneliness like you do. I have my own version. Mm -hmm. And I'll bet Blake has her own version, too. She doesn't have to be alone, though. I was here for her. We all were. She chose to leave us. Why do you think she did that? Hmm? The entire time Blake was at Beacon, she was Look afraid to Weiss. open up people. She tried to keep her past separated from us. Weiss, the she psychologist tried to protect here. us. Eventually, those walls she put up came down and the moment they did the one thing she was afraid of actually happened the universe proved her right no one blamed her for anything if she had just talked to us she would have known that how could i be there for her if she doesn't let me what if i needed her here for me i know it's not easy i wish she hadn't left too the only thing we can do now is be there for her when she's ready. When she comes back. If she comes back. She will. Yang, you, Ruby, and even Blake are more like family to me than my brother or even my own father. I would do anything for you three. And I'm willing to bet Blake feels the same way. So, when she's ready, I'll be there for her. And I know we're not as close, but I'm here for you too. <laughs> Is uh everything okay? Yeah. It is. No it's <sighs> That plant looked really good for some reason. <laughs> it's a weird note I had about that scene. Ilya? Oh god, this is a trap. I'm here. Cause they, they, they want to capture Blake for Adam, Ilya. but they want to kill the parents, right? I know right? you're scared, but you don't have to be. My family and I, we can keep you safe. I'm sorry. Uh -oh. You can make it up to me by helping us stop Corsican Fennec. No. I'm sorry for about what's to happen. I'm sorry. <gasps> no! It's a bat? Oh, what 
the heck is that guy? Girl? Guy? Oh, I think we saw the bat last episode, or a couple episodes ago. Wait. Jesus. Spider? I've got her. Well done, Sister Trifa. Trifa. And to you, Ilya. Man. Why couldn't Ilya. she shadow clone? Come on. What are you doing? I tried to warn you, Blake. I'm sorry. Don't tell me you're sorry. But I am. I am sorry it has to be this way, but you and your family are holding the Faunus back. Because we're trying to protect people? In what world do you live in where attacking the innocent is the right thing to do? The same one as you. There's no such thing as innocent. There's no right thing to do, only what's best for us. There's the humans that still hate the Faunus, and there's the others who stand by and let the hate happen! But you know what snuffs out hate? Fear. Okay, but you're I going to war, so you're gonna lose your numbers. But I'll tell you this. It's gotten us results. At what yeah. cost? Look where it's gotten you. We all have to make sacrifices for the greater good. No, you don't. No matter how much it hurts. And you think killing me is really for the greater good? No. But getting rid of your family is. Mm. You wouldn't. You can't. I Come won't on, let son. You. I know. Let's go, son. That's why you're being sent to Mistral. To Adam. Ilya, please. You don't have to do this. This isn't you. Yes, it is. Is. But I guess back then you were just too busy falling for Adam to notice. I was always jealous of the way you looked at him. I wanted you to look at me that way. Jeez, everyone's falling for Blake. <laughs> but we can't always get what we want. Yuma, with me. You two, get her to the docks. Let's go, traitor. No! Huh? Yes! Let's go, gunchucks. Thanks for the backup. Thanks for the invitation. You okay? No. You heard, Ilya. My family's in danger. Hurry up. Call the police and let's go. Right. Come on, Mom, pick up. Shit. No. Get down. Oh my god. Is it a rabbit? Oh my god. Magic yes, wand looking brother. ass. I'm afraid I'm inclined to agree. Oh. Got saber tooth over here. Oh, no. No. <laughs> Shit. Do I have 15 minutes? I could watch another episode. Okay. I'm gonna watch another episode. Um, <laughs> so, jeez, uh, okay. Um, you know, they're still mad at Blake, obvious re reasons, but we, we understand because we're the viewer, we know her reasons, so hopefully one day they'll reconcile and they'll figure it all out. Um, but yeah, they're alone together because, you know, uh, they all have their own ways of coping with it. And, you know, they, it's it's true, they don't understand each other's loneliness, but the, the, pack, the fact is they have to be there for each other to help each other through it. Um, 
and then obviously you have this raid on the family. Oh God. Um, <laughs> okay. Uh, I, that's it. I and uh, watch that for ne next episode. Thanks for watching. And yeah, let's just jump into this.